Hey guys, watch out this magic. If you want, you can increase the duration of any music as long as you want. Just like this one. Hey hi, this is James and welcome to a new Adobe Premiere Pro tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how you can increase the background music duration as long as you want in Adobe Premiere Pro 2020-20 version. Yes, of course you need to use Adobe Premiere Pro 2020-20 version. Without that, you will not have this option. Originally, it was a feature of Adobe Edition, but in Adobe 2020-20 version, you can use it inside Premiere Pro. So let's get started. So here is the project that I have worked recently and now I want to use this music along with this video as a background music. So I'm just dragging it here. So you can see the music is not long enough to fit with this video. Also the music has some beat drum that I don't want to include. So usually we trim out the usable part and then duplicate it again and again to fit with our video. Just like this one I'm just copying again and again. And one problem is that when you are doing this the audio will not sound perfect hear it out now let's see the magic so i'm just deleting this audio i'm just double clicking on my audio and making a selection of my audio that i want to use i'm just selecting an in point here out point here and then i'm just clicking and dragging it to my timeline now go to window then essential sound Then you will have a panel just like this one. Click on music. Then you will have a option that will say duration. Just enable it. Make sure you have selected remix and beneath that if you increase that number, the duration, the audio track duration will increase. I'm just selecting a number maybe 8 for this audio track. You can see the audio track has been increased. And if I just play back, you can see the audio is sounding perfectly. Now you can trim it down to match with your video duration. Maybe you decrease the volume of your audio track a little bit to match it perfectly. Here you can do one more thing. The audio is interfering with my voice. For that reason, you can use parametric equalizer. To down some frequencies so that it doesn't interfere with your voice frequency I'm just I'm just decreasing some mid frequency and high frequency so that it doesn't interfere with my voice and there it goes I'm just using a sharpness I'm not a key ball and oh my bad video on a sharp to move bad video on a sharp the sharpness is current so that's all for today I hope you have enjoyed this video if you have enjoyed this video you can give me a thumbs up and if you have interest on Adobe Premiere Pro or video editing in general then you can subscribe to this channel to get more videos just like this one i'll catch you guys on the next one until then goodbye